Hey everybody, Chambimbi here, bringing you back another episode of Minecraft. Today I'm going to be bringing you a new series to the channel. It is going to be called Minecraft 101. It's basically going to be showing tutorials on either building or redstone related contraptions in Minecraft. So looking at this, you might be wondering, what does this do? It is very small, why should I watch this? Well, stick around and I'll let you know. So this is what I like to call the super smelter. Basically what it does is, well, smelts things automatically. The, you put this as your input for all your items that either it may be food or ore. Then right next to it to the right you have a chest for fuel like wood or coal. And then once all of that is done it will go into this chest which as you can see already has a piece of mutton inside it to show. To get started we're going to break two holes into the ground just like so. Then in the front one you want to place a chest which is where your output is going to come in. You can make a double chest if you want to make sure you have as much storage needed. Then you want to crouch and place a hopper behind the chest because you don't want to accidentally open a chest. Do the same crouch and place a furnace on top of the hopper. Then on either side of the furnace, place a hopper on it. And then also on the top, you want to place another hopper. Then on top of those hoppers, you want to place two double chests or single chests if you want on top of them. That way we have our input for both the fuel and the food or materials. And that's it. It is that simple. All you needed was three different items, chests, hoppers, and a furnace. Now, let's see if it works. So, why don't we grab out, I don't know, let's get some mutton. I mean, I don't have anything against sheep or anything, but I guess, I guess I just like it. Now, we get something to fuel. Let's get a little bit of coal. And what you're going to see is when I put this mutton inside of the top chest, it goes through the hopper and ends up in the furnace. Then you want to put your fuel on the one on the chest in the side. And as you can see, it's smelting. It'll automatically smelt, as it says. And once it gets through, you're going to see it went straight into the chest. It's a really simple but yet it is very helpful in survival you can have multiple of these dotted around your house that way you can smell many things in a short amount of time well that's it nice and easy tutorial for survival or in creative if you really want to show off your builds if you enjoyed this episode please leave a like and if you really enjoy it make sure to subscribe to the channel again i hope you have enjoyed and until the next one this is chami b signing out